medical emergency question time. So you have a patient, she's in the chair, and all of a sudden, halfway through the appointment, she stops breathing or has difficulty breathing. What should you as a hygienist not do? Terminate dental procedure, remove instruments from the mouth, uh, place the client in a Trendelenburg position, or administer bronchodilator. We do not put the client in a Trendelenburg position. Because what is a Trendelenburg position? That is when their head is down and their feet are up. And we don't want to do that. When someone is having an asthma attack or difficulty breathing, you want to put them in an upright position so that they can breathe. The last thing you want to do is bring their head down. The Trendelenburg position only applies during um, syncope. So syncope is when someone's fainting. So if someone's fainting, you want to put their feet up, head down, the Trendelenburg position, so that all the blood rushes to their head. All the other um, options that are listed there are true. We would stop the procedure, we would remove any instruments from the mouth so that they can breathe properly, and we would administer albuterol, the bronchodilator that will open up, so dilate means open, so it opens up the lungs so that they can breathe. Remember, anytime someone has um, asthma in their health history, you want to make sure that albuterol, that puffer, that inhaler is somewhere present um, on in the dental counter or in the dental op.